Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have a Korean beauty skincare haul for you. And um, some of these products were sent to me for review through Otali. And also I have a couple of products that I ordered off of Soko Glam. And then at the end, I have a couple of products from The Ordinary. Now The Ordinary is not Korean um, skincare, but I wanted to just go ahead and throw it in here anyway. So the first product that I wanna to talk to you about is this product here from Amongt, and this is a new Korean skincare line that Ulta has started carrying. And the product that I have is the Petal Purifying Bubble Mask in Rose. And it's just in a little tub like this. And it kind of looks like a clay appearance. And you just put it onto the face, put it on clean, dry skin, and you put it on and kind of massage around just a little bit and then it will start to bubble and the um, oxygen, oxygenated bubbles will help to revitalize the skin. It also has um, green tea and peppermint extract in it that is for anti-inflammatory. Then of course it has the rose, it has damask rose in it that is for hydrating and soothing. And of course the rose scent of it is just to die for and it does have little bits and pieces of rose petals in it and I will also have inserted a picture of me having it on and what you're seeing in that picture is um, after it has been on for just a little bit and it has already started to bubble and ox oxygenate I cannot get that word out but anyway um, you can use it two or three times a week it's very gentle it's just a very gentle um, exfoliating type um, moisturizing type mask to use on the skin and was very excited to get that. I'm always um, curious to try new Korean um, skincare brands and to be able to just be able to pop into your Ulta and pick this up makes it really nice. And this on um, the price on this is around $25 and it's 100 ml or 3.3 ounce 3.8 fluid ounces. And it says, the strength of beauty can be discovered in flowers, inspired by flowers. The mode. Yes. I'm just going to see if I can see this. It's a fluffy texture wash off mask containing rose petals. Creates cushiony micro bubbles to clarify and purify the skin. So there you go. So to get that. The next product that I have um, that I also received from Otelie is from the brand Kiko. And this is the Free Soul Blurring Eye Balm. Of course, anytime I see an eye balm that's supposed to be blurring, um, I'm going to give it a try because I'm trying to really combat all of this that's happening under my aging eyes here. But it is just a balm. It does have this little... Um, clear type ball on here. I don't know really what the purpose of that is. Does it roll on your eye? I guess it does. I haven't used this yet. I, I used the other, the mask, but I haven't used this because I just got it. But um, it is a little balm that you would just squeeze out and put underneath the eyes. And it's supposed to soothe, smooth the eye contour and provides instant radiance. Um, blemishes are camouflaged for instantly flawless results. And it says the texture blends into the skin, awakening the eye contour and giving your eye a fresh and radiant appearance. So, and there you go. So it does have a definitely radiant appearance to it when it was first applied. Um, I can tell from feeling of it that it definitely has some silicone in it. So I'm not really for sure how I feel about that, but and it almost looks like it has is that just my imagination or did it kind of turn into like a little peach color there? Did it? Can y'all see that? Does it not look like it's a little bit peach color? Now that I put it on, I mean it came out white. Let's try the other hand and see if it does the same thing on this hand. Maybe it's just my hand. Hmm. I don't know, maybe it's just my eyeballs. But it does. See look, that I just... Yeah, it does kind of have a peach tint to it. Hmm. I'll let you know. By the time I, I get this video edited and uploaded, I will have tried it. And I'll let you know in a little annotation down here if 
I was just imagining it or if it really did kind of turn peach. I swear it looks peach on my hand. I swear it does. Anyway, okay. <laughs> oh boy. Eyes are playing tricks. So I did get that from, um, like I said, from Kiko. Okay, the next products I'm going to show you are what I ordered off of Soko Glam. And one is a repurchase or restock, and that is the Claire's um, Supple Preparation Facial Toner. I just showed this in my empties video that I finished it. I've been doing the what they call the seven skin method with my toner. Basically, you're just putting your toner on seven times in a row. You're just using like a pea-sized drop and pat it into the skin. And I liked the, this Claire's ones because it was, it doesn't have any alcohol in it. So it's not drying and it's very gentle onto the skin. So I did pick up another one of those as a repurchase. And then they came out with a new product and this is it right here. It's the Rice Ferment First Essence. And so how I've been using this as, I've been using it as kind of like as a toner. I cannot get my words out. I've been using this as a toner, not as an essence. So I've been using this first and then an essence and then a serum. But um, it's just in this bottle, first of all, this runs around $35. And it's a very liquidy, um, very liquid. Let's see if I can get one a drop out there, as you can see. So it's definitely um, a little bit more liquidy than a true true essence would be so that's why i've been using it as a toner and this has the rice ferment in it which is really good for anti-aging and um for creates brighter more hydrated skin with the rice ferment it also has lactic acid in it and i can definitely feel the last lactic acid working on my skin my skin responds very well to lactic acid so if you like the Sunday Riley Good Jeans, which is primarily a lactic acid product, you would like this. And um, it also has um, licorice root extract, which is um, for brightening also. So I've been using that. I really do like it and it has a nice scent to it. And like I said, um, you can definitely feel the lactic acid. So if you get this, um, you may not want to do the seven layers. Maybe you just do one to kind of let your skin get used to it and then work your way up to the seven layers. And then the next product that I ordered from Soak Glam was this guy here. I had a little sample of it that I had got in my last Soak Glam order and I really do like it. And it's the 5.5 um, Aquel um, Licorice pH Balancing Cleansing Toner. And again, the licorice extract in here is wonderful for brightening. And so I like to incorporate these two together. So what I'll do is I'll maybe do two layers and then two layers and then two layers and then one layer is how I like to do that. And then I had some points that I had accumulated because whenever you purchase on Soko Glam, if you set up an account, you accumulate points and then you can redeem your points for um, special products and I got this product here which is the Real Tea Gel Mask. It's a skin brightening and anti-wrinkle effects in rose from Skin Food. I actually had two of these. I've already used one of them. It smelled really good. It was a gel type mask and it had little pieces of rose in it. Rose petals. And the rows together. It was a really good combination. And then they also sent me a little sample of a cleanser. And this is the cleanser, cleanser, E Nature Marshmallow Cleansing Foam is what that is. So I will be giving that a try. And then the two products that I ordered from The Ordinary, um, my daughter wanted me to order her some of the um, serum foundation she really likes that and they actually have colors in that that are light enough to match her her snow white skin so i thought well as long as i'm ordering i might as well put in a few things for myself so i got this right here which is a mandelic acid it's mandelic acid 10 percent plus ha 
And I've been using a mandelic acid serum from um, Polish Choice. And so I thought I would give this a try to compare the two because of course with this being the ordinary, it was a whole lot cheaper than not, it wasn't Polish Choice. It was Colleen Rothschild, Colleen Rothschild's um, mandelic acid serum. And then I picked this up and it's the 100% L-absorbic acid powder, which is a vitamin C powder that you mix fresh into um, a serum. The only thing that I, they did tell you not to use it with was um, niacinamide. So if you're having anything that's niacinamide, you wouldn't want to mix it with that. But um, I used to purchase one from Philosophy that was a, a vitamin C powder that's around $30. I mean, they still make it and this was less than 10 so you know you can't beat that and that's that's all it is it's just a little white vitamin c powder you mix it fresh into a serum into a moisturizer of your choice and then you have your vitamin c um, treatment that is freshly mixed and they actually did have a little um, scoop here a little bit little bitty spoon to scoop it out with so that is this edition of the Korean Skincare Beauty Haul, um, plus a little extra. So I hope that you enjoyed, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.